How's it going crew? This is Happy Days and welcome to another Terraria 1.3 update tutorial. In this episode we're going to be looking at how to craft all the different Stardust gear which is awesome for summoners in this new update. Okay, so basically how this works is we're going to quickly craft everything and then I'm actually going to show you the items in some combat and explain where and when I think they're good to use. And I'm under attack by a harpy. <laughs> Alright, let's get started. So, first thing is the wings. Uh, all of the new wings need 10 luminite bars to craft and 14 fragments. At this stage, I think they're fairly similar in their abilities. Same as the pickaxe and the axe. So, really, it's up to you if you want you know, your character to be really themed. Okay, next thing we're going to craft is the Stardust Dragon Star, which works very much like one of the, the Frost Hydra or the Spider Queen Star. However, it is massively more, well, I don't want to say more useful, but you'll see, see it in action. It's flying around me now. And the other new summoner's weapon is the Stardust, Stardust Cell Star. And if you loved Ravens before, and believe me, I'm excited about this weapon, this is like upgraded wave ravens to me personally. So that's enough chat, let's see these things in action. Let's go. Okay guys, the first item we're looking at is the Stardust Cell Star. And when you cast it, it summons these little orbs that you can actually see in the Stardust Invasion. They have a teleport attack to get close to enemies, and they also do a ranged attack as well. So they teleport to get close, and then they actually do like a little range sort of thing. They have high damage and they swarm enemies, so they can take things out super quickly. In fact, I just had a Martian Madness invasion and these things were tearing up the uh, Martian Saucer, which I was really impressed by. So, really good summon weapon. Uh, don't think they do area of effect damage, so I guess Ravens are still possibly better against a single target, but it's hard to say because the uh, cell stuff does uh, so much damage. Ravens can only get up to about 100, roughly, whereas these get up to 133, so depending on the armor, like these things would shred pumpkins easily. So very cool, very cool summon. You can get herds of them if you've got the necromantic scroll and the papyrus scarab. You could even throw on a pygmy necklace for even more. Uh, very cool. Okay, next thing we're going to look at is the Stardust Dragon and I've got it attacking Skeleton Prime here. And with the summoner gear it does over 100 damage. I've also got some buff potions on so it doesn't do 133 but it can get up there. And you can see it hovers over an enemy and just does rapid quick attacks. Um, and you can just see it's constantly hitting for over at least 100 damage. Sometimes it's getting up to 150 or more. Now if you couple this with things like an Icor Potion, you can see that with the reduced armor, it's just shredding Skeleton Prime all by itself. And that's not even without adding in other minions. So you can see when you put both these new summoner weapons together, you're getting amazing damage against bosses. And as I mentioned, if you throw in an Icor effect, so I just hit them both once with a flare on, with the Icon buff, they just shred them to pieces. Um, so it makes for a really effective summoner team. Okay everyone, thanks as always for watching another one of my 1.3 Terraria update videos. Leave a like if you've enjoyed this, keep those comments coming to suggest what I should cover next in this amazing amazing update and subscribe if you haven't yet for all the newest updates about Terraria 1.3. Guys as always stay happy. I'll see you soon. This is Happy Days signing out. See ya. And that means that ectoplasm will be yeah getting farmed nicely. And you can see that was dead easy to set up that. So the mobs can cruise up the sides. The mimics can get in which is one of the main things. Yeah we've got lots of good loot. Just oh, he's got three thousand health. <laughs> he's only got three thousand.